kids better have clapped back, otherwise I'm leaving. Kia ora everybody, my name is Sharon Casey, I'm from the Edge Radio Station and I'll be your relief teacher today. Um, so I hope that everybody at Stratford Primary has been doing their online classes and not just, you know, watching stuff on TV because that's not what we're supposed to be doing. Now I've got a maths problem for you that please don't ask me the answer of it because I've struggled with this and if you get it right, then you make sure that your teacher when you get back to school gives you like a prize or something. So here is today's maths question. <coughs> The school is having a basketball shootout. That sounds fun. The person who gets the most shots in the hoop in one minute wins. So, Mrs. Campbell scored 22, Miss Crowley scored 23, and Mr. Dombrowski scored 18. Shame, the ladies really took that one out. So, who won the shootout? How many shots were scored altogether? And how many shots did Miss Crowley beat Mr. Dronsky by? That's really rubbing that one in, it really is. Let us know on the Facebook page. Keep doing your work, guys, and uh, look after yourself. Stay home, stay cool until after school. That's in your house. Straight for primary, Tom Bruce here of the Central Stags and New Zealand Black Caps. Hope you're all working hard and staying kind to one another, to your parents and to your teachers. Now I have a couple of maths questions here for you. Sam made six cookies. His brother Leo made twice as many. How many did they make all together? And the second question, a frog named Max is at the bottom of a 10 metre well. Each day he climbs up 3 metres, each night he slides down 1 metre. On what day will he reach the top of the well and escape? Good luck for those questions and I hope you're all working hard and staying kind to one another. Hey Shefford Primary, Monts Beatham here from Sky Sport. I wish I was giving you some PE to do today, but it's not about PE, it's about maths. So the maths problem I've got for you is this. Miss Hampton loves to bake. She is baking cookies for the school gala. She has made bags of six cookies that she intends to sell for $4 each. Miss Hampton sold 18 bags of rugby ball shaped cookies and 38 bags of mountain shaped cookies. So, how much did Miss Hampton earn from the rugby ball cookies? How much did Miss Hampton earn from the mountain shaped cookies? How much did Miss Hampton earn in total with both the rugby ball cookies and the mountain shaped cookies? Let us know. Hey, Stratford Primary. Uh, so I'm Claire Michelle. I'm an Olympic triathlete from Belgium, professional triathlete, um, and now aiming for the Olympics of 2021. Um, I hope you're all working hard um, and enjoying your lockdown period, having that as best as you can. So I've got two questions for you. So the first one is two numbers differ by eight, and when they're multiplied together, they equal 105. What is the sum of those two numbers? And then second question I've got for you is by rearranging the digits of 568, 568, 
I can make five new numbers. So how many of those numbers would be odd? And I actually have a third bonus question, and that is if you have a packet of lollipops, and the lollies, they cost $2.25, $2.25. If I buy four packets of lollies, how much change would I get from a $20 bill? So good luck with those, and get back to me on that.